Hello folks, this is JC Music Man. I figured I'd make a video wishing everybody a happy new year and uh, tell you about some of the stuff I've been working on. Uh, hadn't really worked on a whole bunch of stuff, just hadn't had no time. I've uh, been dealing a lot uh, with the uh, family stuff. Uh, last four or five months, uh, my dad passed away in October and uh, just been dealing with a whole lot of stuff and just hadn't had no time to mess with anything. Anyway, I just want to give you a heads up on some of the stuff I'm messing with, or I, some of the stuff I plan on messing with, and some of the stuff I have messed with that I hadn't even, you know, done videos on. And uh, one of the things I've been really into lately, uh, especially the last month or so, is the solar stuff. And I'm sure, you know, you've seen a few of the videos I've done with the, uh, the parabolic dishes and everything. I'm still playing with those. Got a couple of those. They even uh, got my brother-in-law and my sister turning on them. They uh, they got a pretty good size one set up. You know, they, they heat water with and stuff, and uh, it works out pretty good for them. But I built me a solar oven. It's three foot by. Uh, it's three foot long. It's nine inches high in the front. It's uh, six. It's eighteen inches high in the back, and it's sixteen inches wide. And I built it out of uh, one hundred percent trash. Uh, I didn't. Uh, don't have a dime in it. It's all stuff that uh, some of the, most of the materials I got off a uh, job I was on uh, building a house, and uh, so it's free. But anyway, my whole point of it is uh, I can sit it out on a good sunny day. Uh, it'll get 300 degrees inside the box. Inside the box. Uh, matter of fact, uh, a couple of days ago I cooked some cornbread in it. It took about a, uh, probably about 45 minutes. I got the oven was about 275 to about 45 minutes to cook a pan of cornbread. And uh, and that, that wasn't bad considering the temperature. The temperature outside, I think, was around 55. It was uh, it was in the low, mid 50s. But uh, I'm rather impressed with the solar oven. And uh, but one thing I want to do with the solar oven is I want to take it a step further. I hadn't seen nobody else do this. I want to take and uh, make an HHO assist solar oven because the solar oven is great, and it it even it even get warm. Even with good, pretty good plow cover, it'll get 134 degrees inside my oven. Uh, no matter what the outside temperature is, and that's one thing that I'm, I'm really impressed about with is the uh, it'll heat up. It don't matter if it's 20 degrees or 100 degrees, the the oven will heat up as long as you have some sun, some some source of light. And uh, but uh, but what I'm gonna do is uh, plan on I'm plan on uh, doing an HHO assist. That way, if clouds come over or what have you, you can, uh, you know, you can turn an HHO cell on using a car battery or something like right there to assist in your cooking. It's not going to be uh, HHO only, it's just the HHO is going to be there to assist it. And uh, I still got to implement that on there. I put on doing that and I'm possible, I'm thinking about adding in some stuff to, uh, uh, some stuff for actually heating water in it too. Have it, make it all like a combo, all in one, all like a camping box. Have it so to heat water, uh, cook your food, and make. Uh, you could actually use it for uh, air heat too. So uh, that's one of the things I've been playing with, uh, and I'm still playing. I, I still got to build and everything, some of it. And uh, the other stuff is I've, I've been playing a little bit with uh, making homemade batteries out of aluminum foil and copper wire or whatever. Whatever is trash, because I'm not buying, uh, about 90% of my experiments are all done with stuff that I get out of, uh, that, I, that I can get for free, or I can uh, utilize stuff that's normally thrown in the trash. And uh, I've been playing with a lot of stuff out there. I've made aluminum batteries, aluminum and using carbon rods out of old dead batteries, and have them light. I had uh, done one uh, back about a month or so ago that... Uh, we light 19 uh, bright white LEDs for, uh, it lit those for five days solid. I had nine of them running series. And, uh, but, uh, like I said, you don't want to spend money on that kind of stuff, but you can, uh, you know, make use of stuff that you normally throw away. Use aluminum foil, the bake, a baked potato or something like that, and when you get done with it, take and uh, roll it up, make a battery out of it. At that you know, make a, two or three of them and light a LED for a couple of days. Uh, it beats throwing it in the trash. But anyway, that's some of the stuff I've been playing with. Uh, I got a bunch of other stuff I want to play with. 
Uh, but that's pretty much it right now. I plan on doing the oven. Uh, my HHO stuff, uh, I still want to do some more stuff as far as the cooking stuff like I was doing. And because uh, there's, there's some stuff on that that I hadn't done no videos on that uh, I'm rather impressed with. And uh, there's some other stuff that I want to, uh, I plan on sharing too to kind of go against some of the, skept the HHO skeptics. And how they talk about, you know, uh, you know, electric is far more, you know, better. And, uh, you know, electric is great. But, uh, I've got some, uh, just, I'll just put, leave it at that. I've got some stuff that I, I put on sharing shortly that, uh, I maybe shed some light on a few things. That, uh, the, some of the math don't answer. And I'm not talking about cars either. Uh, I'm not doing the HHO car thing. And, uh. But anyway, I just want to let y'all folks know what was going on uh, with some of the stuff that uh, I plan on doing. Uh, got a lot of stuff I want to do. And uh, Happy New Year, and hope everybody has a real good year this year.